Okay guys, so we actually received a package today from one of our subscribers, again, um, which is Kerra. Turn down for what? Turn down for what? What's going on guys? Welcome to today's vlog. It is Saturday, the 2nd of February, and we're starting this vlog late on in the evening, late on in the afternoon, I think. So it's late, late afternoon, early evening. Porsche, Vanellope, and Mean Jean are downstairs. They're watching Telly and Minus Sarah's room. The boys are upstairs. They're playing on Fortnite. And I've just got back from the office with one of the new printers that was sent me. Listen to this. A brand new printer that was sent to me. And the hot end is completely ruined in one of them, which is disgraceful. So because they were sent to me, I'm going to have to get the hot end for them which is only about five ninety nine, six pounds but I'm going to be working on it later on and seeing if I can fix it because um, I might be able to fix it yet, we don't know. So fingers crossed we might be able to but I'll check in with you later on and I'll let you know. So where are we up to when it comes to contractions and stuff like that? Well the contractions are still here, what seems to be happening is during the day they're still there, they're not as strong but when it gets to the evening time they come with a vengeance. So we've literally only got 48 hours to wait, technically it's 32 hours now or something like that because on Monday morning we've got to ring triage at about 7, seven o'clock in the morning and they're going to tell us what time to go down so she can be induced. So whether Aurora likes it or not, she's coming Monday or Tuesday. Depends how quick Sarah labours and she does quick labour. I think if... Induced, maybe they broke the water, I think it should be a Monday. Monday. If they break the waters, even if it's a controlled... Um, break the, the waters. Contractions are already there, so she just basically needs an open hand rail, doesn't she? Because you remember when they brought the Porsches, the yeah. Penelope's? Penelope's, yeah. They started straight away. Yeah, they? yeah, yeah. So what's going to happen is on Monday, Curtis is going to stay here tomorrow night with Chloe, and then on Monday, he's going to take Oscar Alpha, Porsche, and Mason to school. Then I'm going to go and pick up Imogen and Porsche at about three o'clock in the afternoon and take them to the hospital, North Manchester, where we'll spend the rest of the evening well, until she obviously, yeah, early. yeah. Or unless I need to pick them up earlier. So everybody's on eye alert. So Sarah's got a few things that she's gonna be talking to you about today. She's gonna put a baby bouncer up and then she's gonna show you a gift that came today. Another gift for Aurora. She's so spoiled and um, she's not even here yet. Bless her. So yeah, we're gonna get today's vlog officially started later that same evening so guys i thought that i would check in with you and give you a little bit of an update contractions are still coming around every 20 30 minutes and today i managed to get some makeup on and feel human again because obviously i don't want to keep looking like death that's the best way to put it so i thought to try and like past time we are going to build aurora's bouncy chair and get that prepared because obviously she's definitely going to be here monday night regardless so whether she comes or not so she's actually going to have no choice so let's start making this bouncy chair and then we can show you what it looks like it's so pretty can't wait to put it up and i can't wait to see how tiny she actually looks in it She's like, because it's so big, she's going to look absolutely mid yeah. Okay, guys, so we're going to open this and we're all going to put it together, aren't we? Say that, I don't even know whether it'll need to put it together or whether it's I think it's already together. Right, just folds out, maybe it just clips out. together. We need to take this wood off. <laughs> wood? Cardboard. Cardboard. Same thing. It's We're going to keep this just to cover the seat so Max don't get on it. Oh! oh it does just clip out, doesn't it? Yes, well, I think it's going to... Oh! How quick was that? We're done! <laughs> <laughs> so... I like it, but... This Why is it black? <laughs> it's a... That's cute. Seat. It's, cute. it's Rosa. It's Rosa. This, like, needs, like... Let's put it on the bed. Do you want to sit in it and just make sure it's bathing material? <laughs> Stand up for it, Porsche. Why does it sit up though? 
go I'll do it take it back I don't think she's going to up that's how small it's going to be look how small she's actually going to be probably Wait, what? small I don't think they can hear you. She always, I always send from the camera. <coughs> Princess Aurora. So now we need to learn how to actually get it to fall down. So does it have clips? Oh, on. Mom, look. It has these to hold it, I think. Yeah, that's if you don't want it to rock. So you put them up. Oh. So then how does she lie down? I'm wondering if. Don't need to do it before. No, it's not that. But let's have a look at the instructions. Might help. It probably is that. It opens. I think you just take it off and wash it. Just gorgeous guys, what do you think? It's so lovely. So, I'm going to take this off. Because we're not taking it back. Unless it was broke. Oh, I'll have to just... And then that would be a shame because she just took the tag off. Mm. And then you can just cover it up like this. So then Max doesn't sit on it. Well, nice so she's there, and then we can so we need to think in two days time it's going to be a baby in here I can't believe it how tiny she's going to be you're going to put her in there two days two days you're going to put her in there or are you going to put her in there no that's when she gets bigger well probably will sit her in it no because being a photographer she's going to have her own Instagram because she's going to have that many pictures taken she's going to need her own I want one with you here yeah we'll have a kids one and then we'll have one for her two so i'm just going to show you how close are. obviously the packaging is still on it but this is who makes it and it's just super cute so cool. and also it is rosa rosa <laughs> the color is rosa the color is rosa it's nice color that isn't it where do we get rosa off it's spanish no Italian. That says oh, Rosa. Well, you got to say it Italian. A Rosa. <laughs> Where did it say Rosa? No, Rosa. 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 Why did it lips are on there? Let's see. Oh. Do you like our lips? Yeah. Oh, they are cute. Look at them. Oh, it's Rosa. Look, mine and Imogen's lips. Well. The way you're saying it is like you're um, Italian. Yeah, Italian or Spanish, not Chinese. Rosa. Rosa. Right, now we've got to be Chinese. Uh, how do, how how do you say in Chinese? I don't know. What kind of time? No, how Why do don't you, you write it down and go Pasa. and translate it Pasa. to see how it's spelled in Chinese? Rosa. What, so is it pink? I think it's rose, isn't it? I think it's... Rose is red, isn't it? Ten years later. Rose, rose is red, red. isn't it? No, you could get pink rose, red rose, yellow rose. Rosa is a colour. Rosa is pink. Rosa... Rosa if... Why are we well, still saying Italian? Pink, <laughs> and it says Rosa. I'll see right. what Rosa is. China. Right, well, Maybe they spelled it wrong and it meant to say rose. Uh, right, they've got really squeaky voices. So... <laughs> I don't know. I really don't know. We're just gonna find out with him. Um, we could have found out with Siri. What does Rosa mean in Chinese to English? It's not Spanish, it's Chinese. How to say Rosa in Chinese? Bro, why don't you just ask Alexa? 
What Alexa. is... Alexa. How what do you say Rosa in, in Chinese? <laughs> no. She, what she, is... Misha Vesma. <laughs> Did she even say Rosa? Rosa, Rosa. I know I'm speaking. Rosa, Rosa. Rosa. Right, what is Ro Rosa in Chinese? Right, be quiet a minute. Alexa, how do you say Rosa? Is it Rosa? Rosa. Uh, Rosa in oh. Chinese. Ignore. It's Rose, not Rosa in English. No fame. Alexa, stop. She's more annoying than you. Rosa. 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 Borsha. 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 Shut up every time you put it on. Borsha. 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 It's not like Borsha, isn't it? Borsha. How do you say it? Let's see how you say Borsha. Okay, guys. So we actually received a package today from one of our subscribers, again, um, which is Kerra. So we're just going to open it now. I'm going to let Alfie open it because he never really gets to open anything. So I thought it'd be nice for him to open this and show you what we actually got in it. And I'm sure there'll be many other presents, so they'll all get a turn um, to open stuff. Obviously, our family and stuff like that, especially when she's born. So we'll probably just go around them all and we can all open something. Anyway, Alfie's going to open this now and show you what we got. Okay, so Alfred, you can now open the package. Should I rip it? Yeah. Just jump in there, son. You've got to read. If there's a note in it or a card, then you have to read it. Portia, smile. <laughs> It says it's for a baby girl. Oh, oh I'm having a boy. <laughs> Sorry to disappoint. Pull it off, it should be like stuck over. Aurora, the name Aurora comes from the Latin language originally. Aurora, the name comes from the mythical Roman goddess of the dawn and from the Disney princess known as Cynthia Aurora also means Eva. beautiful person. Um, May force of the Ah Fan Ah. Is there There's a card. I'm taking it, kids have done them. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want me to read this or not? Me and Dad will read that. I've got another tea there. Aww. Look at that, babe. That is the cutest, isn't it? Oh, Aww, I feel it. So I love Teddy's that are dead so. Aww. I love the dress. She'll kind of match her. I'll have to take that one to the hospital, babe, because yeah. then she... Oh, my God. Look at them dogs. I know, and you know what? She can put that on with her um, oh them little shoes on with her dress. They're so cute. That's some tiny shoes. <laughs> Did she knit them? No, I think she ordered them. She sent me a picture the other day, and they were just, like, super cute. It was like, oh, no, so cute. 
so beautiful. Ah, that's an idea. Put it on the tether. If the headband fits off. Put the ears over the top. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't think they're going to fit the headband. <laughs> she's just, she's just wording. Oh. God. oh. Like there is. <laughs> I wondered what it was. And that's why I said put an air through. The headband's a bit too big for you. Oh. Look, it's baby Aurora. I read the sea. You can pretend. <laughs> She'll soon be here. Not long now. And the wait's nearly over. Hopefully. She might come tonight. Although we've been saying that every night. Yeah. All these contractions and no baby. How can we have so many contractions and the baby not come? So I just want to say a big thank you to Kerry and I'm taking it her kids have made these. So Kerry, when you watch, if the kids did make these, then please just let me know in the comments so we could say a proper big thank you. Um but they're really good so i'm going to show you these separately so you can get a proper look at them and we just want to say thank you for the tether <laughs> and the little booties and the headband she's going to look absolutely adorable in these yeah. and this tether is just super cute when i actually put a shelf up this tether is going to look the part because obviously her corner is like all pink and white and then obviously she's going to have bits of grey in. So she's got a few other teddies that a few of the other subscribers have actually sent to us that I'm actually going to put on the shelf as well. Um, and then the rest are going to stay in a cot, obviously. So she's got like teddies scattered all over. She's got a couple in a bugger. Then she's got a couple in a cot. Then a Moses basket. It's just, it's so good how many teddies she's got in it. So she's going to have such a cute little like memory box when we put everything away it's just going to be amazing so thank you again Kara, and your family and the kids for sending this lovely gift to us we do appreciate it so much it's beautiful so i'm going to check in with dave and see what he's been up to so at the minute dave is currently trying to fix this and he's having a nightmare and yep. please excuse the mess, I've not cleaned up. I will do it in a minute. Nightmare. What's up with it, babe? It prints then after about two or three minutes. Wow. So it's like setting on fire mm. <laughs> that's what that smell was it must have been burning a minute ago oh well you're clever so no doubt by the end of the night you would have fixed it or realise what's up with it won't well, you I can't work out what's up with it because I think I, th I thought that it, it was leaking out of the hot end doesn't look like it's leaking out of the hot end don't know whether or not it's the thermistor, this, which gets hot. That's got stuff around it. It's it's like a I don't know. So just quickly, I'm gonna read the letter that Kerry sent just because obviously it explains about the pictures in it as well. So it says, to Dave and Sarah, here is a small gift to say congratulations on the soon-to-be arrival or new daughter of, if this arrives after. I think your channel is good and very honest and needs more YouTubers showing an honest life, not a fake one. Hope you like the pictures I had to laminate them with an iron. As I don't have a laminator, laugh out loud. 
Take care from Kerry. So <laughs> I just thought I'd share that little note with you. So she actually laminated these with an iron. So I'm just going to show you these now. And they're just real cute, these. And they're just going to be like really nice to just put away and keep. Because these are like the first pictures I think we've had since being YouTubers, are they? So we're going to have to start making like a little like memory box to put everything in. And obviously I keep everything. <laughs> We'll probably end up needing like that a massive storage unit once we start collecting everything. But it'll be really good to just look back on, especially in a few years when we can open like a box. Maybe we could make like yearly boxes, couldn't we? Yeah, that's a good idea. And then like every couple of years we could review like the first box, which would be good. So anyway, I'm gonna just show you these pictures now. So this is the first one that says May the fourth of the R fan be with you. And then there is this one, which is just so cute. Later. All right, guys, we are going to call it a night now. Really tired. Um, <clears throat> thanks for everybody's concerns in the comments as well about Sarah saying that she looks really tired. She is really tired, but she keeps carrying on and on and on and on. Bless her. Um, but it's not good at all. So I'm going to try and get her to rest tomorrow as much as I can. But I've just got in bed. I'll just lay on the bed. I did some more listings for eBay and she's just shown me how the bedroom's going to look in about two weeks' time. So um, <laughs> she's obviously not going to stop. So I'm going to try and go to the office tomorrow in the morning, try and sort out as much as I can, then come home and spend the rest of the day with her because uh, we're going to be going into hospital the day after. If not tomorrow. <laughs> Oh well. So um, do not forget to smash the like button, subscribe if you're not already. The cat's asleep, so sat up. That tries that the night after Yeah, make sure you click the notification bell, it does nothing. Make sure you leave us a comment and we will see you guys tomorrow because we do this every single day.